We're here in Tucson where for the very first time in team history, the Arizona Coyotes are playing on the home ice of their AHL affiliate, the Tucson Roadrunners. I think the building's great. I mean, the locker rooms, um, you know, I think the whole process and coming in here is really nice. I like the building. Fans were great. Um, so it was, it was enjoyable. The venue was nice. You heard the Coyotes were going to be coming. What went through your mind? I was jacked by it. It's a fabulous opportunity. I have to go. I just have to go, and my husband's never going to go. my first like professional hockey game I've ever been to. I'm excited to see how they play. I thought it was a great crowd. I thought uh, I know it was loud. Um, it definitely felt loud playing on the ice. It was loud when we scored. It was good to see. It was good. They were pretty passionate. Uh, you know, it was, uh, you know, it was fun to play in. It was good. I mean, it was uh, pretty similar to obviously what we had in Tucson last year and um, obviously a lot of fans out, uh, you know, supporting and stuff. And, I think it's good. It's obviously great to, to grow hockey in, uh, in a new area, and I think it's getting bigger and bigger here. So um, that's the main thing, obviously, if we can grow the game a little bit more and obviously get some kids to play, that's great. You want to call a guy up, it's a, it's a short ride. Two hours, sometimes it's an hour and a half. It depends how fast you're going. You know, it's good for us uh, to have that proximity for the, the big club. If you couldn't make it out here to the Tucson Convention Center for tonight's game, don't worry, opening night for the Arizona Coyotes is less than two weeks away over at Gila River Arena in Glendale. That's Saturday, October 7th. They'll be taking on their brand new desert rivals, the Vegas Golden Knights.